What's up, guys, and welcome back to some more NBA 2K23. We are back here, and uh, we've got a couple of quests that we're going to be completing today. So uh, first and foremost, our main one right now, our palace intrigue, trying to figure out where our career is going, where we're going to end up. We need to play our next game. And then we've got that leadership conference that we learned about in the last episode. But I remembered we hadn't finished up our clothing line of things yet. So we've got our custom shirt, we've got our custom pants, we've got our custom shoes. And we are going to go visit our potential, you know, kind of like clothing designer, fashion helper, I don't even know, but personal stylist, MP. maybe. What's up? My phone won't stop buzzing. See what she thinks. My teen line sold out, and I kid you not, 17 minutes. 17 minutes? Your so friends are calling for collabs what? all because of you. 17 minutes? I could kiss you. Wait, wait, oh, I don't think my girlfriend would like that part. <laughs> not but... romantically, like the way I'd kiss a winning lottery ticket. Wow. Which you are. <laughs> okay. That's interesting. No, MP, you don't get it. I don't know like that. Madison changed my life. I don't have a million dollar pro sports contract to fall so back on. Crazy. I just got my designs, and mm -hmm. until you showed up, that was pretty much all I had. That and forty-eight dollars in my checking account. Wow, wow, wow. <laughs> what I'm trying to say is thank you. Thank you so no, much no, from no, the no, bottom no. of my heart. Thank no, no. you. Hey, hey, a I don't, million times. I don't think I deserve all this praise. You are fantastic. Your designs are amazing. And like I said from day one, if I can do anything to help get your designs out there, I'm doing it. You did. I'm doing it. You did, thank you. So this is Oh, you deserve this moment right now. Whoo -hoo. I know you said that, but Having worked with Shep in the past, I wasn't sure I could trust you. He left you high and dry, huh? He took what he needed from me and bounced. Once he had that shirt, I never listen, heard from listen, him again. Listen, Sounds like I'm sorry that that happened to you, for real. No need. Here we are now. Come on. Things are good. Come on. You know? Talk on I'm it. happy. Let me have a look at you. Are right, you cool? Yeah. All right. What you thinking? What you thinking? Terrible. Eh. eh. What does eh mean? Something's still missing. All right. What do you think? Sunglasses on your face. Okay, what kind? Hmm. I think you should talk to Tyler Hero. Tyler Hero, right? He's at Moss Point all the time. He's got some of the coolest shades in the league. Hmm. Uh, I bet he'd hook up a fellow NBA type guy. Oh, well, I didn't know you were a hoop head like that. <laughs> well, I'm not. <laughs> right? But I did some research to see what makes somebody cool in your line of work. Mm -hmm. You know? Different cultures have different looks, and I'm not going to send you out there like that, like Please. at Hot Couture. Like, what? Please do not. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not doing that. I mean, that's, that makes a lot of sense, actually. I know, I'm smart, but, you know, go meet Tyler, get some awesome shades, and then get out there, show the world what a man dressed like Audrey Louise Reynolds looks like. You better give me some. <gasps> give me some Audrey. Come on, baby, come on. <laughs> Listen, I look forward to cooking up with you soon. All right? Yeah. Have a we'll good see day. See you soon. Appreciate There's you. not a single thing that we're wearing that matches. I actually am kind of excited to get some sunglasses from Tyler Hero, and it's perfect timing that... I remember this because they were literally just in town for our last game. But uh, all right. So it sounds like we're going to have to go play Tyler, be able to earn his glasses. And then we should be able to wrap up this uh, little segment, be able to go play our next game. And I mean, we got to be a leader. You know, it's all about that leadership conference. We're leading on the court. We're leading off the court. We're leading in fashion. We're leading everything. So here we go. <laughs> What's up, bro? Oh, my God. Hey, what to do, bro? Oh, what's going on, fam? You know, I'm just... Here letting people know I'm out here working. Yeah, I see you. I see you holding it down. Respect. That's God, that's those are awful. Awesome. Damn, that's how you pull up to the courts? That's how you play ball? Nah, not, not how I play ball, but listen. Off the court, there's a reason SI named you best dress. Hey, hey, you got it, man. You got it. But hold on, hold on, hold on. Them shades, though, bro. Them yeah. shades, them joints is tough. Where you get those from? Yeah, they're one-on-one, -on -one, man. You can't find these just anywhere. Right. OK, well, let me play you for them. Oh, you like that action, huh? Three-point so, contest? Yeah, so what, do, what do I get if I win? I don't know, bro. You name the price. Ball on your court. You know what? It's all good, man. This will be fun. Check up, bro. I do kind of like his jacket there. All right. Is this just a straight up? Um, I was going to say one-on-one, -on -one, but it looks like it's going to be a two-on-two. -two. All right. I feel like these aren't the most exciting things to watch, so I'll probably just kind of skip through this. We should be able to get the win that out of here baby come on give me this ball give me that ball ah, i think we messed that one up Ooh, i was hoping our boy was gonna get the board back all right things are going well here just to pop in and give you guys an update oh give me this put it right back up let's go kind of like that uh, i was gonna say kind of like that heat game yesterday but i guess i can't say that because we lost so i take that back one three is gonna win it though this one right here money 
Give me them glasses, boy. Let's go. We'll take it. Hey, Flexing on the fans and stuff. Okay. Okay, I see you. Feels good, man. Got a shooting badge as well. Mm, that's a good game, yeah. my boy. Yeah, good game. You were, you, you were hooping out there. Oh, you saw me out there, man. Hey, by the way, man, I'm good off the sunglasses, man. You can keep them. You know what? I'm a man of my word, though. You're taking these glasses. Bro, bro, bro. I'm serious. Keep them, man. Don't make me tell you again, bro. They're all yours. All right, man, if you insist. Yeah, put them on, man. We look like a clown. Hey, boy, look. <laughs> They look better on me, but you can pull them <laughs> off. I knew you would say something like that, but I, I'll take it. I got to bounce, man, but look, I'm here a lot. I'm sure I'll be seeing you around. For sure, man. You're going to get some more runs in, all right? Look, bro. I will say they've got some really cool, like, crossovers and stuff. Cameos of celebrities and other players and stuff. We still need to go see J. Cole, but uh, all right. It, it said we had to go get these, and then we wanted to put them on our face. I mean, with the hat, it looks a little bit better. Without the hat, they look terrible. So now we're going to head back to uh, to the office, and we're going to check in with Mila and Ashley, see how we can continue to promote ALR. I feel like we're, you know, we've done our part, but I guess we want to make sure she gets what she deserves. I like the look, you too. <laughs> Ooh, definitely suits you. <laughs> okay. These shirts are everywhere, and by the way, I hear Shep is pretty salty about it. Good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And hopefully Audrey get the credit she deserves this time. Mm, I mean, she said that Shep ghosted her after she made the shirts. <laughs> Wouldn't even help pro promote the brand at all. I mean, it figures. Has he ever done the right thing once? Like, ever? No. Not that I'm aware of, no. So, Mila and I have been discussing next steps. Now that you've got your outfit together, it's time to wear it to one of your pre-game tunnel walks. Okay. Okay? Okay. I'm gonna make sure that Nicole Ramon from Teed Up is there to ask you questions about it. Yep. And then all you have to do is talk about how awesome Audrey Louise Reynolds is. Okay. And how your incredibly sophisticated and stylish girlfriend put you under her. <laughs> all right. Perfect. Then. Ashley's on it. All you have to do is show up looking fly. I can do that. Yes, you can. And then after the game, we got the leadership conference. So, a lot to look forward to. Let's I'll make it happen. I stand by the fact that this has to be the worst outfit I have ever seen. I, I really like the shirt. I feel like the pants could work. I, I feel like the shoes just don't work at all. I, I mean, the, the glasses are okay. I'm, I'm, at least we got the bucket hat. The bucket hat's the one thing. I guess I, I like the shirt. The bucket hat and the shirt, I feel like, go really well together. Everything else is kind of a little bit questionable, but um, it makes a statement, that's for sure. So here we go. We've got a pregame fashion walk, and we're going to have an interview about it. Yes, yes, I know. I look like an absolute idiot. Look like my mom dressed me this morning. It looked like my mom let me dress myself before going to school. You know what I mean? So we got that. We're going to talk to Nicole Ramon from Teed Up. MP, looking sharp. <laughs> Thank you, Nicole. Thank you. You know, I have to change up just a little bit. I would say more than a little bit. <laughs> Globe is real. Thank you, thank you. And I've been reading online about you too. It seems you've gone viral of late. Yeah, well, you know, I'm, I'm a man of many talents. Clearly. <laughs> so where did this new look come from? Well, it's actually uh, Audrey Louise Reynolds. You know, she designed the MP show. You've probably seen everyone rocking. Yes. But she also helped me track down some unique pieces to take my style to the next level. Okay. Well, where did this newfound interest in fashion come from? I'm a leader, baby. Making the NBA means I can help great artists now, or it's not new. I've always loved expressing myself. <laughs> Hold on, Nicole. This is nothing new at all. You know, I've always loved being able to express myself through what I wear, as you can see. Um, but as I continue to find more success on the court, I'm looking for new avenues and arenas I can take my talent into. I don't know so if I love that. So you plan on either. having success in the fashion world as well? Plan on. I mean, literally look at what everyone's wearing in the streets right now. I mean, <laughs> I think I'm having success. And I get to have a talented designer like Audrey Louise Reynolds along for the ride. Along for the ride? she's got something that cannot be replicated. And that's what I'm all about, at least. That, that was so a little, a little too, too I believe much. they call it synergy in the brand building business. Yes, they do. Synergy. <laughs> <laughs> Good stuff, MP. Thanks for your time. Thanks, Nicole. Appreciate you. That was a little douchey. I don't know if I liked that one. All right. Let's go ball out. Wait, we got the heat again? All right, a little double header. I'm here for it. I mean, I mopped him up out in the park, so I'm glad to have a, uh, a second opportunity to be able to beat him out in the actual league here. I don't think I'm going to be able to drop 45 like I did last time. Ooh, missed me. In the corner. Right here. Oh, my goodness, dude. Come on, y'all got to hit me while I'm open. 
That's two shots there. Come on. Let's go. Set this pick for me, baby. Set that pick for me. Let's go. Hit me. Turn. And burn. <clears throat> all right. Missed that there. It's all right. We got five points. Five to two. Had one three. Scored down low on Tyler. Playing some good defense. We had a couple of stops. So we're working this out. Let's go. Come on. Stick with him. Stick with him. I got to... I gotta put on my badges, dude. We, we have, I'm pretty sure we have two defensive badges, four shooting badges, and one or two finishing badges that we need to activate. Bit of a slow start for both teams here. Try to play some help D on Lowry. Gonna end up leaving Tyler open, of course. That's how it goes. Sometimes you can get back quick enough. Obviously there I didn't. All right, Trev, let's, let's make this happen. Here we go. Set that pick, run through. Here's Martin, and the call will be against Tyler Hero. I'll take it. Should have went up with it. I thought about going up, but I didn't want to force a shot. I don't know, man. Very low scoring game so far. A lot of defense being played. Nobody's really making anything happen. We're going to sit down at the end of the first. We're going to be down by three at the start of the second. I don't want to be in the same spot as we were last time, man. Let's, let's start to take over before the end of the game. I mean, last game we kind of took over the entire game, but let's try to put our team in a good spot where we got a lead and we don't got to worry about coming back right at the very end. Get in there, get that board, let's go. All right, I say we run it, let's go. Kick it up. Just kidding, not much, much going to happen there. Outside Ubre. Pass to Martin. Rosier outside. Let's it go from deep. Good. And I mean, he can bail us out with that. I, I, there was nothing Rosier's happening there. Our offensive Rosier. plays were not doing anything. Tie ball game. Let's go, baby. Rosier from outside. He's feeling himself. Okay. He's just going to keep us alive. Let's go. Not even running plays, not passing the ball. He's just taking it up himself. Okay. That was that was my bad. I wasn't I wasn't paying attention. Here we go. Let's answer back. Let's go. Let's go. Be aggressive. B E aggressive. Don't lose the ball though. Come on, baby. Give me something. Little pick and roll action. Go up big. Be confident. Absorb the contact. I wish we got foul. I feel like we never get foul. We never get in one opportunities. So I'm gonna help here. Oh, let's go! I, that hit the back of my head. I'm not gonna pretend like I stole that, but we'll take it. Trev, the three ball's not falling today. I, my timing on the release is off. Give and go. There it is. All right. Beautiful play. I mean, if the three ball's not falling, we're just going to have to work our way down towards the middle. We only have nine points, dude. We had like 25 at this point in the last game. Thought about trying to go for a little steal there, get through that pick. Three balls gonna fall here. Three balls gonna fall here. I feel it. I feel it. Give me this ball. I'm just, I'm gonna. It's it's gonna be a little a little pull up too. Come on, baby. There it is. Gotta love when that cutscene pops up. You know what's going in. These guys are putting on a clinic out here. I mean, I'm trying my best, but holy cow. Woo! All right, got our timing down. We do have, we've got full takeovers, but I think I'm going to hold on because we only got a minute 14 left in the half. Come on, baby. Oh, I like that little handoff there from Gordon. Gordon, I didn't forget about what you did in the last episode, though. That doesn't make up for it. Jimmy is a beast. We all knew that, but my goodness. Every time I feel like we're starting to spark something, they just they throw some sort of a crazy alley-oop. Lowry throws up a three. Tyler throws up a three. Jimmy does some circus stuff like that. Here we go. 30 seconds left. A little pick and roll. He's open. There it is. Need a big stop here. Big stop, big stop, big stop. Get through, get through everybody. And here's Butler. Jimmy's we calling for the ISO. In his last game. Just three to shoot. He didn't get it. Let's go. We'll take it. All right. Gonna have a small lead going into the half. Three 
As we saw from that first game, though, we can't we can't let up. This is big. This is huge here. Just got to keep keep going at him. All right, we're in a dangerous spot here, baby. Our team takeover is about to drop. Ooh. Oh. Sometimes I feel like the steel animation. I, I don't know if it's we don't have a high enough steel or what. That just ruined our takeover, too. That makes me so mad. I was so excited. We had a double takeover ready to go. Well, looked like he was going to... Good little take there. Looked like he was going to pick on the left, and then he went to the right. But yeah, I, I went. I, we were in the right position to be able to steal that pass to Hero, and we, it's, we got stuck behind him. I don't know. It's weird sometimes. One for one, two for two. But yeah, we had a double full takeover for us. I hate the team takeover, so I was just waiting for that to drop. And then it was going to be our time, but uh, obviously we got screwed there. I didn't mean to switch there. I, sometimes there, it's like a weird stickiness. I don't know what to say. Safe to say things are not going as planned. All right, we're up by one. We got we to gotta start bringing this, bringing this back. There it is. Nice little pump fake. Get his hands in the air. Make him worried. Make him nervous. Be able to finish that. All right. Up by three. We have minute 51 left in the third. We just we got to make sure we start stacking up this lead here. Team's just not clicking today, man. Ooh, there it is. All right, here we go. Let's go. I was going to say we might have numbers, but we do not. I'm going to try going around. Okay. I like it. I literally just said, hey, we're not getting the chance to go to the line. Let's make sure we're taking advantage of it. There it is. <laughs> Messed up that second one, dude. I don't I don't like my... Is there like a different release for free throws? Because I don't like my free throw release. We're going to sit down. Oh, man, this makes me nervous. We were up by four. And we're going to come back in down by three with a minute 31 left. It's the same thing as yesterday, bro. The same situation. Oh, we aren't... We don't have our takeover or anything. We need to stop. I'm going to have to. My, my jumper has not been falling as, as well today. I mean, 50% is still pretty good, but. Our team, like, I, I don't know what it is. Our team's just not playing well. Not at all. They're, they're not switching. They're not finding the open man. They're not really doing anything. I missed that. Stop him. Oh, my God, dude. We're going to lose another basketball game to the Heat. Come on. Here we go. Somebody set a pick. Fudge. I'm missing everything, dude. It's just not my night. I don't know what else to say. That's a wrap. Down by nine. This this hurts. Come on. Woo. Okay. Down by six. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh, dude. Tyler's going to make these is the problem. We got to steal that inbound. Oh, I'm so upset. Why did they take us out? They shouldn't have taken us out. It was the end of the game, dude. I wasn't that tired. I could have played the rest of the game. Oh, we missed it. They're all over us. Here we go. There it is. That's another one. 22 seconds left. Four-point game. Oh, get on him. Get on him. Get on him. From beyond the arc puts the I almost the stole that. How did we not steal that? Gordon, don't take the ball, okay? This, the, we, we, I need this this time. Please. <sighs> Dang it. You can just see and feel the passion behind the play of power. I mean, it's all up to us here, baby. I'm going to run and pop up at the top of the key. And the Hornets with possession here. <laughs> I'm not wasting any time, baby. Beautiful shot. What? How? How? I was in between him and the ball. Dude, we're just grasping at air? Bro, this is unbelievable. We're, we're actually coming up in the clutch. We got ice in our veins. It's not going to be enough, though. Shoot, he made both of those. That's going to be our last timeout, maybe? I'm not sure. Okay. Come on, baby. I'm just going to go for the same thing-ish. I'm going to go for the exact same play. Your thoughts, guys? Gonna have to work oh, we got it again. <laughs> We've got our takeover, too. Dude, if he misses one of these, that's potentially it. All we need is him to miss one. Got to make sure we turn on our takeover. Dude, everyone. Are they cheering MVP? I don't know what they're. All right. Here we go. That misses. And looking to even the score with no, I missed it! Oh my god, no, I forced it! I forced it! We had time! What was I doing? No, dude! Oh 
Oh, I got nervous. I got nervous. Oh, who's shooting this? Young? Oh, I got so nervous, bro. I, I, that, was, that was the biggest choke of my life. That was the biggest choke of my life, dude. If we could have only done that. I can't believe we just had the two games that we had the last two games. I'm so upset. I hope you guys entertained. These were these were two of the, probably the best 2K games I've ever had. I'm so upset. Why couldn't I have done that on the one that counted, on the one that mattered? I mean, it's it's over. There's no way. We can't get down the court in two seconds, even if we were able to steal the inbound here. Ah. Uh, um, unless we had a timeout left, then we could do our, our quick our quick thing. We need another timeout. We just don't, it's it's the same thing that happened in the last one. Uh. That one we had. That one we had an opportunity and I, I blew it. So I, I I can't even be mad, dude. Honestly, these games are what make character. These games are what make badges. That one we did miss a few more shots earlier on in the game, but we fired it up right at the very end, as always. So that felt good. I uh, I would have. I would have killed to have that one playback. We had six seconds, dude. We had time. Check social media to see how your interview with Nicole Ramon was received. I don't think it's going to be very good. <laughs> Yo, you see a man MP's legendary fit? He looked like he stole his mama's credit card that went on a shopping spree in 1997. <laughs> no, he looked like a clown. That's an insult to clowns. Uh, yeah, you're right. Clowns be having some fire fits, some shoes. Oh, man, I'd rather wear a wig and a big red nose rather than whatever MP got on. I, I agree. Oh, you want the flowers to shoot out the water? I always wanted one of those. Oh, somebody's birthday coming up. Hey, okay, appreciate you, King. <laughs> oh, I got you, brother. <laughs> but this looks terrible. Yeah, that's bad. That's bad, man. I deserve I that. that on. Man, this two-loss streak is killing me. We're about to go to a leadership conference. Talk about leading a team to losing. Ugh. I just want that three back. I've been firing. We were everything was good. I was feeling it. My timing was locked in. Things were looking perfect. And I just I got a little bit nervous. Hey, nice shirt, bro. I respect it. Anyway. Foundational Thinking Leadership Conference. Keynote panel with Peter, Peter Abbott, marketing expert and MP NBA star. Located in conference room C3 on the third floor. Got my name on the sign and everything. My man. Do you see the crowd out no, there? No, do, do I do you see it? Look, look, I am glad you made it here. Listen, when we are up there, if yeah. you ever feel out of your depth, Probably could have changed. Give yourself a little, come on, I just give this, yourself man. a little ear tug, and I'll jump right in, all right? Bro, I play in front of 30,000 people. <laughs> I got this. Look, I'm sure you will. Just, you know, in case you aren't, I'm here. I'm here for you. All right. Are all right. you, though? Gotcha. Let's make that happen. I don't sure. know if he has the best Woo. motives. Thank you, everybody, for joining us. <laughs> when you harness your passion, you harness your future. Mm -hmm. Huh? Mm -hmm. All right, now. Okay, okay. Next question. This mm -hmm. place is empty. Oh, how about you? Yes, you in the red. What can we learn from each other? I'm sorry. Yes. I actually thought this was a, a real estate convention, so I... I just, <laughs> I'm, just gonna... I'm, so, I'm sorry. Uh, I know there's a question in there. Okay. Hi. Just uh, whenever you finish, just pass it around. Okay. Thank you. Hi, I'm Harmony. Okay. Um, okay, so do you have any advice on balancing uh, culture with results? Hmm. What? Basically, I have an employee who is really, really good at his job, mm. but he's also a really, really massive jerk. Oh, man, massive jerk. Huh? Sounds like a chef. Yeah, yeah right? We, we've been there. How many of us has been there? Right? Okay, okay, um, this is tough. Uh, <laughs> This guy's um, not, he's not legit. He's MP, fake. Yeah, yeah, you, why don't you take this one? You must fake. have encountered your share of talented people who are difficult. He's one of those Absolute fake work. marketing gurus Absolute. on like Instagram. Question, You're in my garage. Yeah, I think it, uh, it kind of goes with the, uh, the territory when, when playing in, in a team sport. Mm. Mm. Okay. Yeah, so what guidance? Guidance, guidance can we share with this, this mindful businesswoman? Dude, I'm taking L's on and off the court. <sighs> well, ultimately, you can't let the culture be eroded by a bad apple, no matter how good he is, hmm. because a happy company is a strong company. 
So just let my company go down the tube so my employees aren't uncomfortable? Oh, no. Got it. No, no, no. That's not what we're saying. Now, Harmony, uh, you might not like this one. But if you feel like you're scared to fire him, then you need to lead by example. Mm. Because if you don't stand up to this person, if you don't let him know that his actions are not acceptable, Go ahead now. sooner or later, sooner or later, it'll empower your employees to do the same. You know what I'm saying? Mm. So if he doesn't change his ways, then you need to can him. Mm. And one thing I will say is, you need to show him who's boss. Ooh. I mean, that's not bad. Show him who's boss. Thank you for that. But this is still pain, painful. Wow. I mean, huh? Out. Oh, jeez, man. Okay, maybe I'll take the next one. Harmony, is that good for you? Can I go now? Yeah, 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 if you must. Yeah, thank you. All right, all right, who's next to share with us? Huh? Over here, huh? over here, uh, over here. Ooh. You, sir, right there. You, you right there. Uh -huh. It's getting better. <laughs> <laughs> oh, is that call right there? Oh. I mean, okay. Uh, let's, I, yeah. This so, question from the gentleman right here. Okay. My dog. I was wondering if maybe you could give some advice for someone who's outgrown their mentor. Wow. Um. Now that's actually not something to be upset about. It's something to celebrate, you know, because a true mentor should be happy if that happens. You know, I think any advisor would want to see their mentor, their mentee, reach a point where they, how do I say this? Uh, where their advisor is obsolete. Oh, wow. Yeah. Oh, whoa, 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 wait a minute. So now I'm obsolete? Yeah. Huh? <laughs> I've lived a lifetime of hot dogs. What have you done? Dad, he's just saying that it's my restaurant and I'm entitled. Hey, you don't even display your ketchup. It's problem. my restaurant. Whoa. I'm entitled to my own condiment display. Okay. And now. your condiments are embarrassing. <laughs> just Bro, like you. Is this really a 2K game? I'm uh, really playing NBA 2K23 right now. I'm sorry, bro. I didn't know that no, was no, your dad. No, it's, it's, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> oh, okay, well, now, um, thanks, MP, for helping out. You know, you know what? How about we take another question from one to someone else? From Wait, the hold on. Hold on. I, I can uh, just ask. Let me ask another question. Are, are you sure? Yeah, I got this. Uh, you look like you have a good question. Yeah. Would you like the mic? Um, hi, my name is B, and I'd like to thank I'm, you. I'm sorry. Can you speak up, dear? Yeah. <laughs> sorry. Um, I'm just a little bit what? nervous. And yet, you're asking a question. Now, that's a very brave thing to do. I think that deserves a round of applause. Everybody, come on, come on, come on now. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Bia, um, right? Thank you. Please. B. B. B, B please. Oh, my gosh. B from the um, old games, dude. She was so annoying. Uh, yeah. So, you mentioned earlier that when you were in college, you won a basketball competition match. I did, yes. Yeah. Um, a few of them. Cool. And then you transitioned into the professional league where you were very young and many people, some even on your own team, felt like um, felt like the organization made a huge disservice in drafting you over someone more talented and perhaps one even would say a handsome player like Shep Owens, oh. who has unbridled athleticism oh. and uh, uh, beautiful uh, B, structure. B, hey, I don't mean to be rude, but... Um... Was there a question somewhere in there? Yes, absolutely. Uh, given those circumstances, how can anyone currently look to you as a leader? Hell nah. I feel like these blue answers haven't been good so far, but the red answer is like, I, I'm, that's just not going to look good. You know, B, that is a really great question. Uh, frankly, because of all those things you just mentioned. Um, Gotta stay level-headed. You know, there are some bad choices uh, that people still think were made, uh, but I can't control those. Because what I can do is show up every day, do my job, and help this team get better each day that I'm out there. Because a leader doesn't have to be the most talented or the most popular or the high-flying player. They only have to be willing to do whatever's necessary to help the group succeed. Mm -hmm. And that's what you got in me. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Well said. Drop the well mic. Said. And Thank walk you. out. I'm still Team Shep. She dropped the mic. 
That's all right. I don't care. But go on. Okay. <laughs> let's uh, let's do another. Can I please go home, Who man? Here has any thoughts to share about what we've learned today? I'm ready to go home. Huh? Yeah. Or, uh, oh yeah. Right here. Uh, ah, we're good. Okay. <laughs> Call it. Thank you. I, I think that's exactly what we needed. I didn't give you enough credit. Really? It felt like you were trying to get rid of me. <laughs> those, those, those were challenging questions, and I, I assumed you weren't up to the challenge. So I kept trying to pivot away. But you? You handled those questions with aplomb, man. <laughs> A plum? <laughs> you think so? Yeah, man. You you did. Look, MP, leadership isn't Self -confidence. about having the answers. It's about being it's willing to take the questions in the first place, man. Look. Anyways, I just want to apologize because I was underestimating you. And I won't ever make that mistake again. So if you ever need me for marking or anything... You know where to find me. So this is a whole test. And I'll give you the friends and family, Ray. All right? <laughs> yeah, I appreciate that, Petey. For real. It's Peter. <laughs> My bad. Peter. I got you, man. And, uh, I had a good time. Yeah? Yeah. Despite it all, I had a good time. Yeah. <laughs> Likewise. My man. I still don't think I like him. I don't really believe, I just don't trust him. Maybe that was kind of a test and he was trying to feel right, us well, out, out and teach us a yeah. lesson. Yeah, okay, cool. I also feel like he's just kind of full of so. I'll see you around, MP. I feel like we handled it well, though. You can't, can't go wrong with that. Handled it with class. That last lady, man, she was looking for a fight and we didn't give it to her. So, uh, looks like they want us to head back to the office to be able to talk about it, have a little debrief. After that, I think we could call it a day. I'm saying, Chef, when you gonna host a leadership conference? Like my guy, MP? Oh, he's such a mature young man. A great young man. Yeah. Homeboy's a few missed jump shots away from selling knives <laughs> on late night TV. <laughs> I don't know about knives, but I'm about a juicer from him. You too can make $1,000 a day work from home. Click the link below and find out how. <laughs> <laughs> that is what content. he... <laughs> Peter looks like. Oh, crazy. Uh... Sounds like. Okay, I... You know... I feel like sometimes his critiques are wrong. What up, what up, what up? I got your message, man. You wanna talk to me? Yeah, um, what's up? <laughs> Wait. Is this a joke? Cause this, look like, this looks like a joke. Nah, it's, it's not a joke, MP. All right, all right, let me, let me get this straight. Babe? Don't babe me right What is now. it? Because it was you that wanted to work this thing from the floor up. We made this decision as a team, all of us. Don't go to Bobby right away. <laughs> oh, trust me. This okay, is my city. I know the city. You're hysterical right now. The sky is not falling. We have options. Yeah, I mean, we can fix this. You just got to stay calm, all right? You know what, what is it? It's you that I should be mad at because you're supposed to be the one who knows what he's doing. But look at us right now. Look at him with this stupid face. Six to six. Jet. <sighs> After all the hard work that I put in. Six, nine. It's gotta be a joke, man. It's gotta be a complete joke. Billboards have very little penetration to the, the thought space Ashley, of sports fans. There was Ashley, just an Ashley, Ashley, I don't want to be penetrated no. by anything, Ashley. Not right now. Look, I get why you're upset, MP. Is it like a bad billboard or something? This. You're right. We can't fix this. And I'm gonna be the one who fixed this, okay? So I need you to call Bobby right now because I'm done playing games with you guys. Can you do that for me? Understood. How bad could this billboard be? What is it? It's over, oh, oh, it's, it's Shep with a Perco Latte Cafe billboard. I mean, I mean, that's kind of messed up. We're here in Charlotte. Why would Shep have a billboard in Charlotte, especially right next to our office? I feel like it's not the worst thing in the world though. I feel like we're kind of overreacting, but it sounds like we're moving forward in the business side of things. And that is all we really care about. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Ooh, we're playing the magic next. That should be fun. Looking forward to that. Drop a like if you guys enjoyed. I'm going to see you guys in our next episode. Catch you all there. Peace out.